my pet peeve is very much vendors that, that promise to solve all of your problems overnight. Uh, and, and we're often seeing products sold as, as silver bullets, and in reality they are far from silver bullets. So I guess my pet peeve is the, the overselling by a vendor of their solution. I don't know a lot of people do a lot of vendor bashing. That's true, and sometimes it's deserved, sometimes it's not. But my pet peeve is still where we get products that are um, not secure out the box. They're not secure by design, um, and there are vulnerabilities. Apathy is one of my pet peeves. Actually, there's a really good quote by Ian Lobbin from uh, GCHQ where he said, 80% of uh, security incidents could have been reduced by doing things that we already know. And that's a really true statement. We know how to do good security. You know, the attacks that I used to use when I was an ethical hacker are exactly the way that I still break in now. And that was eight years ago when I still had hair. They're convinced that most people don't care about security. Which frankly, I disagree. If you look at the number of people on the floor here, and a lot of these folks are not security people. Go on the floor, look at people's tags. You'll see a lot of these folks are IT managers or even specific business unit folks really wanting to, to educate themselves. So security is not boring. The, the thing which drives me crazy is the fact that people won't take the time to think about a decent password. I mean, I think it's one of the major things that we uh, see being hacked all the time. And how many times do we see, you know, one, two, three, four, and QWERTY and all the rest of it? Uh, it seems a shame you know, that we could improve our security quite significantly just from that very simple thing. You may have the most secure password on the planet, um, which still most people don't, but if you don't lock that machine of yours, or even the phone today, the iPad, you know, I've seen, there's so many iPads out on the floor that people are taking on, and me being very observant, most of them are not using passwords. And today everything is on an iPad.